We present ConvexNet, a differentiable decoder of 3D polygonal meshes based on convex decomposition. There are a variety of 3D shape representations that can be used in deep learning, including voxel grids, surface patches, and implicits. While these represent the shape globally, researchers have also proposed the use of primitives, such as oriented boxes and non-oriented Gaussians. And today, we introduce the use of convex decompositions as universal approximators of 3D geometry. When using traditional explicit representations, the inference phase is straightforward, but training requires careful treatment. When using implicit representations, training cast as a standard classification task, but surfaces need to be extracted by marching cubes. We propose a hybrid representation based on convex decomposition. As it is simultaneously implicit and explicit, it inherits the benefits of both words. We achieve this by leveraging convex decomposition, a classical task in 3D graphics. Not only are convex decompositions universal approximators of 3D geometry, but they are also an essential tool for several graphics tasks such as physics simulation. We now introduce our differentiable universal approximator of convex domains. We start by having an encoder network predict the parameters of a collection of half spaces, and reconstruct convex polytopes as their intersection. Further, we introduce a layer representing the corresponding indicator function. The animation at the bottom highlights the properties of this non-parametric differentiable layer, where we highlight the permutation invariance and smoothness properties that are beneficial to training. We can predict any non-convex object by simply taking unions of convexes. As our representation is a function, this is achieved by straightforward pointwise max. In our encoder, we output two set of quantities, parameters beta that correspond to the shape of convexes, and transformations t to express the location in space. As we work with functions, everything generalizes effortlessly to 3D. Here we show two example 3D decompositions. We train our network via a stochastic loss. Given a batch of query points, our network predicts the corresponding occupancy, and gradients are backpropagated whenever there is a mismatch with the ground truth. We also employ auxiliary losses to help convergence by encouraging convexes not to overlap, removing a new space in the convex parameterization, and ensuring that gradients do not vanish. At inference time, given the predicted half spaces, we first convert them to points via a duality transform. We then compute the convex hull of these points, take the dual of the boundary edges resulting in points in the primal domain whose convex hull is the desired polygonal mesh. This means that our network can take an image as input and generate a model that is directly usable in traditional graphics pipelines. As an example, here we show a real-time rigid body simulation. We evaluate our method against others that attempt to reconstruct 3D geometry given multiple depth maps. We compare our results against leading methods such as occupancy networks and structured implicit functions. Note we achieve state-of-the-art performance by a significant margin on this task. Here, we also show results for single-view reconstruction, that is, generating a 3D model from a single color image. Our performance is on par with methods that only perform surface reconstruction. However, note our methods also perform shape decomposition on top of reconstruction. Here, we compare our method to those that perform shape decomposition as a collection of boxes or a collection of blended Gaussians. Note how our reconstruction quality for a given number of primitives is always better, while also keeping a closer connection between the surface of the parts and the surface of the full object. Here, we visualize the Tisney plot of ConvexNet. We also showcase the interpolation of geometry in the ConvexNet latent space. Note that shapes can be interpolated smoothly even across different object classes. We would like to conclude by mentioning this relevant work also at CVPR 2020. Note they focus on learning the compositional graph and reconstruction of sharp edges. Our source code is publicly available. Thank you for watching.